I'm like shaking, partially from Dayquil, but also because I'm intrigued by the life of the Mr. Beast. What? Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel today. How you doing? What's up? In today's video, guys, I wanted to dive into the world of Mr. Beast. I wanted to see how the hell does Mr. Beast think? So, in order to get into the mind of Mr. Beast, I'm gonna be investigating one of his newest videos called I gave people $100,000 to quit their jobs. And I wanna see if he offered me $100,000, would I quit my job? Would you quit your job? What would you do? I honestly don't know what I would do. Anyway, let's get into it. <laughs> I'm in front of a restaurant with a hundred thousand dollar check. I'm curious if you would quit your job for a hundred thousand dollars. No, I don't think I would. Like I have got bills to pay. You can get a different job. My boss would not be happy. This girl's like, yeah, I know it's a hundred thousand dollars, but my boss would never forgive me ever. A hundred thousand dollars for now. Would you be mad if she quit for a hundred grand? Not at all. Are you serious? I'm your favorite employee. I would quit. He's like, girl, you're a good employee and all. I'm your favorite but nothing personal, it's a hundred thousand dollars. A hundred thousand dollars. Quit. You heard your boss. Okay, I'm putting my two week notice right now. You have no two weeks. <laughs> yeah, girl, go. In this car is a hundred thousand dollars in double back. He's not playing around. You want to see a hundred thousand dollars? It's in the back of my trunk. In double back. Let's go. Mr. Beast, thanks to you, I can quit my job now. I'm so happy. <laughs> we're just getting started. We have hundreds of thousands of more dollars we're giving away next bit. I'm like, what? what is he going to do now? What is he going to do? Now we're going to do it again at Walmart. Walmart. Oh, jeez. Have either of you seen the channel Mr. Beast? Yes. I was curious. Would you quit your job for $10,000 in cash? No. <laughs> I figured you'd say that. You don't actually have to quit your job. Do you want 10 grand though? He's like, listen, I'm not gonna tell you to quit your job. We're not actually gonna make her quit her job. It's like, I get it. You may spend your money in two hours and then you come to me and you're like, I quit my job because of you and I didn't think that I was spending that much money. Yeah. Do you want 10 grand though? You can have 10,000. Is you blind? You can have 10,000. We just found that my grandma can't stay for cancer. I'm sorry. Oh, no, you're sorry. This is God way of working things out. Like, it's, this is such a blessing. Grandma, you're gonna be good. Shut up. You're gonna be good, Grandma. I just shut up. I'm on a football field with two ex quarterbacks. Can you throw that football to him? You guys just made $1. All right, that's pretty cool. So he's giving them a fair chance, a dollar. Now here's the thing. If one of you drop it or it touches the ground, you lose all your money. I would be like, Mr. Beast, I'm sorry. I need $5 per pass. One dollar. It adds up, but you're going to be there for a while. You guys just made why, one why, dollar. Why, 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 why. It's a while. This is an $800,000 mansion, and this is the key to the front door. Knowing if you pick the correct key out of this fishbowl that unlocks this door, huh, huh, you get to keep this mansion. What? All these keys. You pick the one for this $800,000 mansion, and you're good, Noah. You're good. Pick a key. No, wait! Good luck. Don't forget the luck. He's dumping right. the keys out. This could be an $800,000 decision. Nolan, you're taking forever. Pick All a right. key. Come on, Noah. Is this the moment of truth where you keep that $800,000 mansion? Is it? Oh, that was a bad decision. I'm literally, literally going crazy. This key unlocks the house. He gets a mansion. Oh, thank God. It's way too bad. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Yeah. Bitch. Screw this key! Screw this key! I mean, do they give him another chance? I have no idea. I'm like shaking, partially from Dayquil, but also because I'm intrigued by the life of the Mr. Beast. We are now at an airport and this is a pilot. I fly plane. I, I fly, fly plane. plane. I already love this guy. And I want you to take this piece of paper and make a paper airplane. And if it makes it past this line, he gets $1,000. 5000 10000 And if it makes it all the way past this line, $20,000. He better put fans and make that freaking fly. Because anyone who knew how to make a perfect paper airplane, it would be Wayne. That would be me. Do you think you're going to win the 20 grand? I'm going to give it my best shot. Every word that comes out of this man's mouth is a meme. That would be me. I'm going to give it my best shot. I'm going to give it my best shot. I fly airplanes. I fly planes. This man. Decision. Oh, oh. That's not bad. It only halfway made it. All you right. just won $10,000 in cash. I'll oh. take it. I'll take it. He's like, I'll take it. I'll take it. Listen, $10,000 flying a damn paper airplane seems like a sweet deal. And it's cash. No tax. Can we just throw this money in your plane? Yes, sir. Put it right back here. Take that money. Put just put it, right it back, back here. here. Now that the money's in your plane, the only reasonable thing to do is fly off, right? Alright, let's go give away more money. You better fly away, man. Fly away before Mr. Beast comes back with that tax return form. What? Now we're on the side of the road, and whoever helps us change this flat tire first gets the car. Hey, we got a flat tire. Hey. If I was there, would I help Mr. Beast fix the flat tire? Would you guys help Mr. Beast? Nope. 
What a jerk! Yeah. Yes, let's go, we got somebody! We've literally been on the side of the road for over an hour just waiting for someone to help us. I really like this guy. He said his car was falling apart. He's being very helpful, very kind. This is a perfect guy. This man has such a good heart. He's like, this happened to me like many years ago. Doesn't happen anymore because I know how to drive and avoid potholes and not make my tires fall off anymore. Many years. Thank you so much for helping us change this tire. Did you see that camera over there? We're actually a YouTube channel with 50 million subscribers and since you helped us change the tire on this car, it's now yours. What? He's like, the car's now yours. And the guy's like, what? This car can't be for me. Here's the key to your brand new car. I have no words. I have no words either. This right here is David. Dave, if you can hit a hole in one, I will give you one million dollars today. That is a sweet deal. If you can hit a hole in one or whatever the hell it was, you get one million dollars. Wind's coming off a little left to right. It is a little wet and damp, 60 degrees, which is a little bit cooler, so the ball's not gonna wanna fly as well. He's really calculating everything. <laughs> I'm starting to get nervous for a million dollars. Mr. Beast was like, oh my God. Imagine I had to give this man one million dollars out of my cash. I would have a heart attack. Oh, dude, it's like actually going in that direction. Oh, snap. Oh my, oh, my gosh. That is so close. You didn't win a million dollars, but if you can hit it in on this next stroke, I'll give you 10 grand. This poor man, he's like, if you could get it in this stroke, get it in there. I will give you $10,000. Oh, my God. Thank you so much, guys, for this opportunity. It's unbelievable. Yeah. That's the best way to put it. He didn't make that hole in one. I wonder how the football players are doing. Gentlemen, what is up? Dude, it's almost dark out. Yeah, it's it's getting rough out here. This is how many times they've thrown it back and forth whoa. so far. Whoa! That was my same reaction. I was like, whoa. whoa. And this guy was like, whoa. whoa! I mean, dollars do add up, guys. If you save a dollar every minute of your life, you too could be at $6,712 in no time. I have one challenge before we go. If you go 10 yards back and do one throw, I'll add $5,000 to your total. You ready? Yep. Oh boy, I'm there. You threw it. <laughs> they are going home with some bank. Our boy Chandler here is hungry. Chandler's gonna order a pizza from Papa John's, Chris is gonna order a pizza from Domino's, and Carl's gonna order a pizza from Pizza Hut. That actually sounds really good right now. Comment down below, Papa John's, Domino's, or Pizza Hut. I wanna know. Every pizza is delivered first, we're gonna tip that pizza delivery driver $10,000. Whoever picks that driver that arrives first, we're gonna give your mom $10,000. Oh yeah, my mom. Yeah, my mom. my mom. Don't even call the driver, I'm just gonna give my mom the $10,000 every time. I'm gonna be like, mom, 10,000. Mom, 10,000. Mom, 10,000. Order your pizza! Oh my god, I'm so good at this. It'll be for delivery. I want a pizza. Are you not looking for anything specific? Nope. It's a rush order if you can. Tell them to drive it This is actually very nerve wracking. <laughs> Imagine waiting for that pizza and one guy's like coming in 25 minutes. I would be like, if you could bring that pizza in five minutes, I will pay you extra in cash right now as a tip. Papa don't gotta know. I'm going to the Domino's app. Create new order. Delivery. No tomato sauce. No cheese. Just bread. Bread pizza. It said, hold up, this pizza doesn't look right. You think? They were like, you don't want anything. You just want dough. <laughs> Literally. I want the dough. We have an order from you that's small hand pizza with no sauce and no cheese. She's like, I just have to call and confirm that you want a pizza with no sauce and no cheese. Yes, bread pizza. Omar just texted me, he's nine minutes away. What? I was wondering about the status of the delivery. I'm very hungry. I'm very hungry. Yeah, Chandler, you're very hungry for some dough. <laughs> Awesome, thank you. You can tell him, never mind, I don't want it. I love you. I love you. Omar's three minutes away, move. Uh, hey, Omar Jimmy. has entered our neighborhood and will arrive shortly. He was like, Omar. Will arrive shortly. Get to my door. Hey, Omar. Chris. Come on, come on in, come on in. I love you guys' video. Oh, perfect. Well, guess what? Since you were the first one to deliver the pizza, here's $10,000 in cash. This guy from Domino's is such a huge fan of his videos. Get out of here. Look at that, look at Mr. Beast's face. He's so excited to give this guy $10,000 tip. He's like, oh. Oh, perfect. Uh, I'm speechless, guys. I just can't believe that Mr. Beast is spreading this much. Red pizza! This was an amazing, amazing video. Thank you guys so much for watching again. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye. Ooh.